Hey guys, my name is Mohamed Jazzy and welcome to my Math 142 video presentation. Now, I've chosen to do question 12 from cheat sheet 8, which asks us to convert the polar equation r is equal to 2 sine theta to the Cartesian coordinates and sketch the graph. Now, to answer this, we know that the polar, polar equation is r is equal to 2 sine theta, which is, we'll call that equation 1. And we know the relationship between the polar coordinates and Cartesian coordinates is x is equal to r cos theta and y is equal to r sine theta. Now we move here to then say x squared plus y squared is equal to r squared cos squared theta plus r squared sine squared theta. And we see that the r's are common so we move it outside and that reads our next line which is x squared plus y squared is equal to r squared open bracket cos squared theta plus sine squared theta. And we also know through our identities that cos squared theta plus sine squared theta is equal to 1. So sub that back in and we get x squared plus y squared is equal to r squared and we call that equation 2. Now we look at r is equal to 2 sine theta and r is equal to 2 y on r. So then therefore we can come to the conclusion that sine theta is equal to y on r. Now if we go back up to this line we can move r over to this side and so we multiply it and we get r squared is equal to 2y. Then we see r squared is common between these two, so we're going to sub in equation 2 into this equation here. So then we get x squared plus y squared is equal to 2y. And then we move the y over to the other side, so we subtract it and we get x squared plus y squared minus 2y is equal to 0. Now we want to simplify it, so we use the completing the square method, which reads x squared plus y squared minus 2y plus 1 is equal to 1. And we can see that y squared minus 2y plus 1 can also be simplified in and put at the equation y minus 1 all squared. So our next line, we, we show that and we say x squared plus open bracket y minus 1 close bracket squared is equal to 1. And we can see that, that this can be put in the form of a circle. So we see that x minus 0 all squared plus y minus 1 all squared is equal to 1. And therefore, we come to the conclusion that the equation is a circle, we have the center 0, 1, and the radius is 1. Now, once we know all of this, we can then move on to graphing the equation, as that's what the question asks. So, we graph the equation we've got here, which, which is x minus 0 all squared plus y minus 1 all squared is equal to 1. We see that 0, 1 is the center, when we go 1, 1 positive, 1 negative, and same horizontally and we get a nice looking circle there. Thank you so much, I hope you've enjoyed.